you know, that bathroom was, was on, on the bus was like, oh, my God. And I remember Godfrey Cambridge. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, that was awful. Godfrey Cambridge, we were on a we were on a trip. I don't know if you want to hear about this. Sure, why not? <laughs> yeah, we were on we were on a trip through Pennsylvania. We were going to Johnstown, Johnstown, Pennsylvania, and it was like a couple of years after the flood. And I don't know if you know Pennsylvania, but it's a long, long climb up up the mountains to get to Johnstown. And we were coming from. We had about a 300 mile trip that day. So we're going along, and it started snowing, So and it was cold. It was a winter tour, and we had all the windows closed on the bus, and we had a standing rule that if, no you, had to, if you had to take a dump, it was never, it was let us no know, and we'll... Bus. Yeah, you do not drop an axe on the bus. <laughs> because, the bus. because the smell in the bus, because all the fumes from the back of the bus kind of waft their way up to the front. Right. So the rule was if you had to go... Let me know or let somebody know, and we get to the bus driver and say next, next road stop, pull over, and somebody, you know, we got to we got to take a break. <clears throat> so as we're going going up this hill, and we know we got about an hour's climb up at about 20 miles an hour up this hill in the snow, and here comes Godfrey Cambridge down. Now Godfrey, I don't if you if you know Godfrey's history, went up and down in his weight, yeah. went ridiculously went from being real skinny to real heavy. This was one of his heavy points, and this was the last tour that Godfrey did with us. And he would stop at like Howard Johnson's and have four hot dogs, four chili dogs, oh, and a couple of hot fudge sundaes. <laughs> and this was the type this, of this diet before he was they on. talked about cholesterol, and there was no yeah. Reason. <laughs> so now Godfrey goes walking back to the back of the bus, and one of the guys says, "Where are you going, Godfrey?" He says, "Oh, I got to take a shit." And we said, no, you can, no, 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 you can't do that. You got to hold it till we get to the next place. He says, I can't. I got to go now. <laughs> so he gets his back there, and all of a sudden the guys are all asleep because it's such a long trip. The guys are all asleep <laughs> in the back of the bus. All of a sudden, from the back of the bus, you hear, oh, <laughs> no. and, and they start back. moving toward the front of the bus, opening the windows of the bus, <laughs> opening the windows. And the snow is coming in the windows, getting all over the seats. But everybody's up in the front three rows of the bus with all the windows open. All of a sudden, the door opens, and out comes Godfrey. And he looks, he goes, where'd everybody go? <laughs> and, dying. Oh, thank God, we were only about half an hour from the hotel, but everybody stayed up in the front four rows of the bus, all crammed up there, <laughs> until we got to the hotel. And then Wally went out and had to take the take the bus to a, a service area and have it cleaned. Oh, my God. And still, for the next three days, it was pretty oh. rank. Oh. oh, man. But it was, yeah, that was... Uh, but, oh, my God. All the windows opened and the snow coming. <laughs> oh, God, it was hysterical. <laughs>